such a design. Hello. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I have just problems with my. I mean, we just seen you, but it's it's fine now. Yeah, it can't. Yeah, you know, it's it, it will come back. You yes. Know, you yes. Back. Okay. <laughs> good evening, Anne. Hi. Good evening. And welcome to our conference. This is the last the last session, actually. We came after the last speech from the from a, an important politician that was yes. positive to. Yes, uh, I, 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 I had a, a short uh, impression. <laughs> yeah. So it was in English, so that was a good. That's no, okay. Yeah, but uh, yeah, I think we have a lot to do. In, yeah. in, uh, so we feel very positive for the future. So thank you for joining us, and this is a great. Uh, it's a great pleasure having you. And then I think uh, uh, we. I mean, the, the concept is. Uh, this is a sign of which is belongs to to you and me and then uh, uh, what we want to always when we sign off every year we do some some new things and we do mm -hmm. uh, always we uh, let's say give a chance to the youth yeah uh, in in the country and also after the the, con the the conference in order to keep it alive with with the youth so and I wanted to to allow you to do a short presentation of our uh, let's say uh, sign off announcement that we will do and then we will follow up in the next month which is related to the tourism uh, uh, for the 2022 which is a year of growth I think yeah. with, with all these things that's, which are already what we have gone and what we expect it's a bright future so related to that I give you the floor is yours so you can explain a little bit and then we will do the final announcements Okay. Okay. Uh, I have a prepared a chart about it, but uh, I will over give after this chart. I have a last chart to to give them an impression what they can do as a tour guide, and then I think I will over give it to yeah, you. That's yeah. Very good. Yes. Yeah. I think these are all only five charts, and yes. uh, if you will allow me <laughs> to open yes. the presentation, I think you, are, you are able to open the presentation. I think, uh, if I'm not wrong, you can do the share the screen. Yes. Ooh. Yeah, you can share your screen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, no. In the middle, you have you go in the middle where you have the, sh the share screen. Ah, you know. Yes. Now we are here. Yes. Yes. Yeah, we we'll see it. Let's zoom here. Yeah. Just give do it big zoom and then. Yeah. Now we have it. Yeah? Yes, this is correct. But now I have a problem with my camera oh. once again. Oh, it's okay. No, you don't need to. I mean, the, it's it's fine now. You can just continue present. And then when you will sign off from the Zoom, then the, the then you will appear again. Okay, now oh. it's fine. Yeah, now, now it's, it's fine. fine. Yes. There's something wrong. I don't know what's happened. Okay. <laughs> Okay, that's technology. I mean, I hope next year we will do it in, in person. But, but yeah, when, I mean, always when you plan a conference, we need to start it by July and August. So we, and at that time, it was not uh, unclear what would happen in the winter time. But I mean, next year, I'm hope, hopefully, we will do we, it in person. We all will hope. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. In better times. <laughs> so thank you. The floor is yours now. We can continue. Can I start? Yeah, you can start, yeah. yes. Hello, everyone. My name is Annegret Goller. I'm from Germany. Greetings from the coast uh, of the Baltic Sea to the coast of the Adriatic Sea. I'm based in Germany in the north and a city with the name Kiel. We are a big harbor city and uh, yes, but the, our sea is a cold one. I remember my time in Albania uh, to be on a warm Adriatic Sea in November, and it seems as it uh, was September for us in the north of Germany. Mm -hmm. Today, it's a great honor for me to announce the contest. Uh, uh, as uh, the people said, I'm a manager in tourism industry, trainer and consultant. And um, 
we want to talk about, do you want to represent your country? Did you ever heard about a profession of a tour tourist guide? Did you? Many of tourism professionals and experts started their careers uh, as a tour guide. And all of them, they said, all these questions, are you familiar with your home country? Are you proud of your city? Are you proud of your country? Do you love its nature, its heritage, its gastronomy, its tradition, and of course, its famous people? And do you like to be with the people and do you like to communicate? And will you be able or can you express yourself in a foreign language? And do you want to improve your knowledge? And the best way is speak in that language to those who speak it as their mother tongue. I remember I had a tour guide in, in Russia and her German language, I'm German, <laughs> uh, was so excellent. After two years, she worked with tourists on a cruise ship. She had any accent. And this is a wonder. And that's why I think tour guiding can advance you personally or can be your professional future and take your chances. You have it in your hand. And um, we have a nice project and um, I will start with this. Start to presenting your city, your homeland to tours and start with an internship. Start in the summertime, learn about your city, learn about your country and give all your knowledge to the tourism. They are the first time, maybe or the last time in Albania. You have a wonderful green country. You have to see, you have the mountains, you have wonderful restaurants, wonderful gastronomics. I was in Albania a few years ago for only four days. And I was so impressed about your country because I hadn't any idea about it. And that's why for me, it's important that the young people has to present and represent their country to understand what to be an Albanian and give it to, to, to people from all over the world, especially to the people from Europe. They are very close to the Balkan countries, but they know not so much about it. And I think it's important to introduce your city where you live. You know your city very well. You know where are the best restaurants, you know where are the best bars, and maybe you know where are famous people, and it could be not only the mayor or uh, a politician. It could be your neighbor, a farm, a former teacher, or uh, former people who works in the museum. Show all your knowledge to the visitors in the summer period of next year. And how, how we can call this is a free walking tour. And um, we will develop a project uh, with a, a agency of work of Albania and with a little travel group. And we will help you to start your professional life to work with tourists. And okay, you can improve your communication skills within the work with these tourists from all over the world. There are tourists from Germany, from England, from France, maybe from Italy, maybe from Poland, maybe from Russia, maybe from USA, who knows? And you will understand another culture because all these people, they have their culture, their questions, their, their knowledge, their, 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 their backgrounds. And you, you will learn to, to work with these people. And in this fact, to understand what means customer service, what means service to work with other people, to show him something nice. And we want to learn and to teach you how to create your own experience in tour guiding. Each tour guide has his own art or kind of guiding. And you have to think about how you will do it, how you will show the city. One people do, does it in this way, another in another way. And you can learn it 
and you can work with all the knowledge you have at this time. And yes, I think all you are waiting, what about the contest? Yeah, it's up to you. I think be one of the best 10 students in foreign languages, German, English, Italian, and the vocational schools. I think I do not explain the name of your cities because it will be wrong. <laughs> My knowledge in Albanian is uh, like zero, <laughs> but uh, you can read it. I think you will be able to read it. And we will offer you a free five-day training in tourism and tour guiding, including one certification with which you can work as a tour guide in summer. This, this training includes this internship. I'm, I've talked about it. And um, you can do these free walking tours. They are free of charge for the tourists, but uh, believe me, you will generate an income uh, in form of tip. And I think this will be a good start to be a good tour guide in future. Why? All the big tour operators and touristic companies uh, in the world are looking for very qualified tour guides in different ways. One takes people on trips to an area and explains the interesting details about it. These tour guides are working on cultural round trips or other round trips. Another part of the tour guides welcome guests at the airports and look after guests in the hotels by the sea to assist or to advise in all questions. This is a very interesting work. And the third, uh, we, name it, we name it animation, entertains the guests in fitness, sports, events, and of course, also in childcare. And of course, all tourist companies are looking uh, for qualified guys for hiking and cycling tours in the mountains, uh, in, in, in small groups. You have, you have to have a knowledge about the nature in the mountains, how to, to be in the mountains, how to live in the mountains. Think about your home base of your homeland. Think about your nature and take all these to be a tour guide. And now I will over give my word to Elvis because we start also our profession together in the last few years. <laughs> Thank you, Professor Noverane. Uh, and this is really great. Thank you very much for the explanation of this. And uh, you are truly a professional uh, from tourism industry, which you, I mean, and beside all on the product level and management for tour operating, which is uh, exceptional. You are also a very good uh, professor and a very good endorser or you give uh, inspiration to all your um, students and all your I mean all your uh, trainees so this is a we are really honored on this and uh, uh, continuing in this what I'm uh, announcing now is that in a few in the few in the coming days we will announce this initiative and then in January and February we'll start Yes. To launch this uh, initiative for youth all over Albania for this, these cities that we discussed. And we hope this will be the, the way, the new way of um, starting your profession from your city, from your place. And as you said, most of the CEOs in, in global level now comes from the background, either from tour guiding or from travel mm -hmm. agent, because they, they come from the ground. And those are the most successful ones. Yes. So, and uh, that's true, and uh, that's why I wanted to, to be with you, and I'm honored to be with you to announce this, this competition and this, uh, for, the, for the next, uh, this contest, because it really will be a, a great journey for, and a, a full opportunity for many Albanians. Okay, we would have loved to have a thousand, but uh, we should start with small numbers, but I think in the next years, this would be a great tradition that yeah. many other companies could do, huh? And yes, I think so. Yeah. So give it more chances to, let's say, to, uh, to youth to find themselves and find a nice job and follow a career after. Yeah. 
I forget yeah, the last yeah. shot. <laughs> Maybe yeah. you will see me personally as your trainer. Yeah, yes. I, I'm absolutely. very hopeful about it. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. yeah, I'm sure that we will find a way. And uh, no, we will work on that. And you, you'll yeah. be our yeah. trainer for that. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you, you for inviting much. me and see you once again. Thank you. And, uh, Thank you. And I wish all the best to all of you, but not only, but also Albanians. And, uh, uh, see you next year in the same time, hopefully with much, much more uh, good news and uh, much more people involved in, in, in different industries and yeah. with more skills. Yes, I hope so. We need it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye. -bye. Bye. Okay, thank you, Mr. Kothiria, thank you, Ms. Goler, and thank you to everyone for your participation. A special thank you to all our speakers and panelists from around the world for taking time to speak to the youth of Edbasan and Albania. We hope to see all of you next year. Until then, take care of yourselves and each other, and happy Youth Day! Faleminderit e gjithve për pjesmarje në tuaj. Një falenderimi veçant për gjithë folsis dhe panelistët tanë, shqiptarë e ndërkomtarë që gjetën kohën për të folur me të rritë e qytetit të Elbasanit dhe Shqipëris. Shpresoj të shojmë të gjithve vitin ardhëshëm, deri atëherë, kujdesu një për vetën dhe njërë tjetërin, dhe gëzuar ditën e rinisë.